The first ever softie was introduced in uh, 1987. It was designed and made down here in uh, Libby's Drive in Stroud by John Gozard. We always cut our teeth originally in broadcast. Our products have to work without any question every time they're pulled out of a bag. We've always made things here. Um, uh, it's all handmade. I was taught 17 years ago by the same lady that's still making them now how to make them. The people who are making it um, understand how important it is that uh, the product works, doesn't fail. We have to check every single um, item that goes out the door. Um, the staff are used to us checking their work. Um, prior to me checking it, they check it themselves as well. So um, I don't mind if it takes time for them to do it. It's important to get it right. I don't want anything leaving the building without it being perfect. Everything must be correct before it goes, and that is our aim of production. We had some of the toughest customers, and we still do have some of the toughest customers in the world, who expect it to work every time. And we like to test things to see whether they fail under UV or moisture or sweat. When you look at it as a product and you look at the materials, whether it be the rubber, the foam, the backing on the fur, uh, it's all critical to us that it's done right and it's also why we, we tend to stay very local for uh, suppliers because just to know that a product works the same way as it does when it goes out the door as it does 12 months, 24 months, 36 months down the line, very important to us. very proud that our products are the best. <laughs>